love. Such an amazing feeling, but so hard to find, which is why today I have gathered up seven guys in an attempt to help her find love. Yes. Welcome to Finding Love. Hi, my name is Stefan. I'm 24 years old and I'm from Austin, Texas. What is going on guys? I'm Yero. I'm 24 years old and I'm from Houston, Texas. Hey, what's going on guys? It's Abdulio. I'm 23 years old and I'm from Austin. Yo, it's your boy Playboy Frankie. Um, I'm 20 years old and I'm from Southeast. Let's get it. My name is Ruben. I'm 18 and I'm from Houston, Texas. Yo, what's up guys? My name is Abbas. I'm 22. Saw my competition. I'm here to win, I ain't gonna lie. I'm also from Jersey City, New Jersey. Hopefully she liked that. Let's go. What's up guys? It's Will is different. I'm 23 years old and I'm here to be some A1 game. Alright guys, we have met the guys. Now it's time to go to the office. Compete, man. Compete. Because the setup today is crazy, guys. I'm telling y'all, man. 2024, we're going insane. We're done with the little lame, you know, videos, bro. We upping the game. Look at this. Got a live view of everything that is going on in that other room. Testing, testing. Can you hear me? Yeah. Can you hear this? Um. <laughs> yes, I can hear that. <laughs> sorry, that was Edwin. I'm so sorry. Not Mr. Edwin. Yo, you're nasty, my <laughs> boy. No, no, Bro, you're disgusting. <laughs> Alright, before we get started, let's go get an interview with Valerie and see how she's feeling. Miss Valerie. Yes. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the channel. Welcome to Finding Love. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad now to tell be us, here. Who are you? Where are you from? What is your age? What are you looking for? So my name is Valerie. I go by Val. I do marketing and social media for a company. I am 24 years old and I am looking for, I guess you can say my forever partner. I do want to get married. I do want a serious relationship, nothing casual. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the by the way, man, peep the room, peep the room. I'm telling y'all, man, we put in that effort 2024. By the way, guys, if you guys are confused as to oh, how I met her, she is my wife's best friend. Yes. And she has been single for, what, like 21 years? Yeah, that's fine. About. She about. has been single for a very long time, has gone on multiple dates, but no, no luck so far. I was like, you know what, Valerie? I'm going to take it upon my hands to help you find the love of your life. So that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna bring you the first guy. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm Good really luck. nervous. I'm Hopefully nervous. we find you love today. Oh my god. Okay. I feel like I feel like Mr. Cupid up in here. Alright, it is time for the first date. Let's go ahead and choose the first victim. <laughs> Alright, who's gonna be the lucky first? I wanna go like in between. Yeah, like, yeah. I'll, I'll save you for the yeah, save, 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 save me. Save me. Save me. Yeah, you're gonna be like a special guest. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Who wants to make the first impression? You feel me? The first one is the one that sets the tone. Bro. Oh, you wanna go first? Go Let's first. get it, man. That's crazy. <laughs> the youngest in the room is the one with the biggest balls. That's <laughs> insane. That's insane. All right, my boy. This might just be the day you find love. Might have to. <laughs> I'm not usually the, the love person. Uh -huh. I, will, I have an open heart. Mm, mm -hmm. 2024, we're doing a new thing. After this door, bro, you're on your own. Yes, sir. You ready for that? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's take a break. Let's take a break. I think I'm ready. Three, two, one. Go get them, tiger. <laughs> Nice to meet you. What's your name? Valerie. Valerie Ruben. Hi, Ruben. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Who are you? I'm doing good. How about you? Good, good. How old are you? How old are you? Can you ask for the age already? About 21, so 21. Sure. How old are you? Older? Lower. Lower? Yeah. You're how, how low? I'm 18. <gasps> Is that a deal breaker? Yeah, I'm 24. But That's six It years. doesn't matter. What brings you here? Why, why are you here? Obviously. Trying to look for some love. Okay. <laughs> okay. But I don't know. What brings you here? The same reason. I'm trying to find love. I want to get married. Where are you? Where are you with that? Nowhere near. Nowhere near. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Probably like in the future, but we could sure. we could build up to it, you know. Oh, okay. Hello. 
I want you both to share how long you've been single for. I have been single forever. I've never had an official relationship. Ever. Damn! Damn! That's kind of sad. That's kind of like you. Huh? All right, bro. <laughs> how many relationships have you had? Like, official one? Uh-huh. Like, two. Okay, okay. But you just graduated high school, I'm guessing. Yeah, just. Okay. I want you both to share how many people you have both hooked up with. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you want to go first? Yeah, one. One? I say like a good five. Cap. Or six. Five or six? Well, I think I lost track. Oh, so it's more than six. I, I think so. Oh, okay. <laughs> good for you. you no, know? nah, not good for me. Bad for me. Oh, okay. At least you're aware. Mm -hmm. That's a good thing. I want you both to share your first impressions of each other. You look young. I look young? Yeah. I like your hair. Oh, thank you. And you got a pretty smile, too. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> got braces for three times. Braces? Yeah. I look at you some, but... Well, if you ever live in Miami, I can get you some braces. You're from Miami? Yeah. Alrighty, Ruben. It was really nice to meet you, though. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> thank you. Wow. <laughs> My boy went in for the handshake, she went in for the button. That's that's crazy, man. Let's go talk to my boy Ruben, man. It wasn't meant Your to be, bro. Your age got to you, brother. I know, I know. It wasn't meant to be. It wasn't meant to be, bro. I'm still positive that one day you'll find love, bro. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, <laughs> we'll help you. We'll help you one day along the, in, in the future. In the future. Alright, it's time for the next person. Who's gonna be the, the second one? Hey, brother. <laughs> the brother. All right, guys. So the reason why Ruben went is because he he came to support his brother. But then I was like, Ruben, just hop in there, bro. Just you know, and go in. What if what if you guys find love? But I didn't know my boy was that young. Damn. But hey, at least you 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 know you had the experience, man. Hey, you, since you guys can't choose for yourselves, I'm gonna just choose like this. Y'all ready? Three, two, one. Abdulio, come on, let's go, Abdulio. Bro, what do you look for in a woman, bro? Like, what, what are you, what are you looking for? Someone to ride with. Someone to ride with. Someone to hop in the passenger seat. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Respect yeah. to that, respect, respect to respect. that, respect bro. That. Once you go through this door, you're on your own, okay? All right, bro. Come on. Three, <laughs> two, one. You go through this door, you're on your own. Try not to trip, bro. I got you. I love you, man. Love you. Take care, bro. Hopefully, you find out. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hi, you doing? Good, good. Nice to meet you. Abdulio. I'm Julio. Abdulio. Abdulio. Nice to meet you. I'm Valerie. Valerie? Yeah. All right. How old are you? Uh, 23. Okay, 23. How old are you? 24. 24. Mm -hmm. uh, you from here? No, I live in Miami. In Miami? Yes. Are you Latina? Where do you think I'm from? To me, you're Spanish. Ooh, okay, that's good. Um, bueno, aquí está mi español. Yo hablo así. Eh, me llamo Valerie. Vivo en Miami. Tengo 24 años. Ah, uh, eres de Cuba? No! What? Cubans speak like, hacer que hola. De México? No! Oh. Colombia. Okay, sí. Estaba pensando en eso, pero Hello! Hello. Hello. All right, guys. I want you guys to both share one thing you find attractive about each other. Who's gonna get you? Like how you walked in. It was a good impression. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I like your hair. Oh, thank I like you. Your curls. Oh, good for you. Thank you so much. Are you like? Are you enjoying this? Um, I was a little nervous. Not gonna lie, but I like it. I feel like I got. I got the hang of it. You got the nerves out. Yeah. Yeah. If, like, your relationship with God, how would you describe it? Uh, I would describe it as pretty good. Okay. I pray every night. I wake up and I pray. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I try to carry him with me everywhere I go. Carry okay. him in my heart. I have a question. Period. Yes. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Mm -hmm. I don't have a question. <laughs> Valerie? Yes? Ask him to take his beanie off. 
take your beanie off. <laughs> He said that was such a weird question. <laughs> that, was, that was that was more like a request. Yes. Right. Yes. What do you rate him now? Oh, I don't want to rate on physical appearance. Um, a six. Yeah. That's good. That's fine. I can live with that. Okay. <laughs> he said I can live with that. What do you rate Battery? Battery is an eight. Period. Very high Period. What do you like to do at night? What do you like to go out? You like to go clubbing? No. No? I don't club. Um, you like to stay and play soccer? I don't, play soccer! At night, usually I just have like, I'm very involved in my church, so I have like meetings or I plan stuff with my friends, like game nights, love game nights, um, staying with my family. I don't really like go out much. <laughs> I want you to tell Valerie where you would take her on a second date. I'd probably take you, probably take you back to Austin. Well, I'll take you walking again, up against Zilker or okay. Lady Bird Lake. Okay. Take pictures. Probably go out and get a little heart-shaped taco plan. If you okay. Like tacos. I love the real tacos. I know. I love. I, I like being a photographer, so I'll be a photographer. Are you from Austin? Yeah, I'm born in Austin. But you live in Houston. No, I came all the way over here to see. <gasps> no way. That's a real one right there, ladies. Hey, get you a man that is willing to drive three hours for you. Oh, no. My Battery. Yes. How do you feel that Abdulio made the decision of driving three hours to come and see you? He said two. He just added that. Oh, uh, no, for real. Um, I think that's really sweet. Like, thanks. Like, I feel honored for sure. I feel honored too. Two hours. But thank you so much, but I'm going to. That's fine, go ahead. Thank you for driving the two hours though. No problem, no problem. <laughs> Alright, thank Alrighty, you. Alrighty, bye, have bye. a good one. Have a good night. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. I have to go ask her why she declined, bro. He was, he was, I would have dated him. My boy, y'all do it, yo. What it is with me? Bro. It is what it I is. I personally, bro, would have, like, been like, I would have said something crazy, bro. No, I was I was a little nervous, not gonna lie. No, like if I was hurt, like I would have been like, Adulio, take me back to Austin right now. Oh my God, bro, right? I would have yeah, put in bro. the bit, mamas. Yeah, bro. Love you, Abdulio, in the chat, man. My boy drove two hours to be in my video. You feel me, man? Hey, that's fine. Why did you pass on my boy, Abdulio? Um, he's just not my type. Okay, valid, valid, valid. But he's very sweet. If Obviously, if you're watching this, thank you so much. I, I think he was really sweet. He was a really sweet guy. Solid. So I guess you're looking for the opposite of a nice guy. Uh, no. No, <laughs> I'm not. No, I, I like a nice guy. When it is broken, huh, Edwin? That's what they want, bro. That's they don't want nice guys like you, bro. I don't know why. You know what, Edwin? It's your turn to sit down in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, time for the next person. Alright. Who's up next? Oh, you ready? You ready, huh? Might as well. well what made you want to go next? I don't know. Just got to get it over with, you know. Spent my time. are eating you yeah, alive. They eat me up. I just got to get it done. <laughs> I can sense a little bit of nerves coming from you, so let me give you a pep talk, alright, bro? What was your name again? Stefan. 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 You're oh. him! I am. You're him, well, bro. I'm not him, but I'm him. Yeah, no, you're, you're yeah, definitely never, not him. Never, never, but you're him down yeah. here. Oh, yeah. Like, when you walk into a room, you're the one that like, girls right. break their necks for, bro. Oh, yeah. yeah, and you're the tallest one in the room everywhere you go. Everywhere bro. I go. Everywhere you everywhere. go. And you remember, bro, you have a fresh face. I just you got look yesterday. But this man, I heard, I heard that she, had, she has like a thing for slits on the eyebrows. Did I see it? Peep that. I knew it was happening. Bro. Hella confident into the restroom. Nice good, to meet you. good. My name is Stefan. Nice to meet you, Stefan. I'm Valerie. How's it going? Good, good. Full process for sure. Oh, yeah. How old are you, Stefan? 24. 24? Oh, okay. Yeah. What month were you born in? March. So my birthday's coming up. You're going to turn 25. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's good. 
Um, what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm an insurance agent, so I work for Affleck. So, you know the duck? Mm, you're not from here. You're not from here? Give him yeah, a, give him a quack. Give him yeah. a quack. Uh, so, we, it's like this insurance quack. company. Quack. What was that? That's a robot. What was uh, that? Okay. <laughs> so, basically, uh, I sell insurance to businesses and stuff like that. Oh, how long have you been doing it for? Uh, I've been doing it for about six months now. I don't know if I really want to stick with it because mm -hmm. I'm getting more involved with my church, so I might actually work for my church instead. Okay, you mentioned church. Like, are you a Christian? Yeah, I'm a Christian. Okay, what church do you go to? Uh, it's called Foundation Christian Ministry. It's in a little outside of Austin. Okay, yeah. so you don't live in Houston? No, I'm actually from Austin. Oh, yeah. okay, so you drove too? Yeah, I drove down here. <gasps> Valerie! Hello! I want you to ask Steph what he thinks makes a girl attractive what do you think makes a girl attractive a woman attractive um her drive i guess okay. so basically i like a, a girl that is very like motivated and good? wants to like help motivate me also okay so basically like yeah i would say i would say her drive how would you describe your relationship with god um it's definitely grown a lot mm -hmm. and within these past couple months i just uh, started serving as a pastor's assistant okay so i'm getting way more involved um i volunteer for rush which is this thing at my church with the kids to help them bring closer to god valerie ask him how long ago his last relationship happened how long ago was your last relationship Seth? my last relationship was about eight months ago Okay. Yeah. Have you been in multiple relationships? Is that your only one? I've only been in two relationships in okay. my life. And were they long term? How long did they Yeah, they're both long term. The first one was about a year and a half, almost two years, and the last one was about three years. Yeah, it's going pretty good, bro. They're flowing. Okay. Yeah. I don't even gotta ask nothing. When I mm -hmm. date somebody, I'm like looking for a wife mm -hmm. because that's my ultimate goal is to have a family and find somebody that helps me and like wants to follow God with me. Okay, I like yeah. that. I like that. I feel like I'm definitely looking for the same two. I don't want to get married. I want to get around. <laughs> Little robot! Wait, 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 guys. Wait, wait, guys. I have a question. Uh, okay. okay. What was you guys' first impression, impression of each other? Spice it up. Um, I think you're really sweet. I think you carry yourself well. Um, I, I think what I really like is how you're explaining your relationship with God. I think that's very important for me. I want you guys to give each other a compliment that's physical, not about a personality. It has to be about each other's physical appearance. I would say you have a very beautiful smile. Like, it was the first thing I noticed when I came into the room, and it just, like, brightened my mood up so much oh, more. Thank you so much. Um, I think for you, you have very sweet eyes. Very it's sweet that pet talk that I gave him. Mm -hmm. Where are you from? Um, well, I was born and raised. <laughs> I was born and raised in Austin. Okay, and how about your family? Uh, my mom, well, not my mom, my grandma came from Mexico. So okay. she uh, was from uh, Durango. Okay. But I don't speak Spanish. No See, way. It, my mom spoke Spanish and my grandma, but it stopped at me because my dad was white. So, like, I'm half white, half Mexican. Oh, wow. Ellery. Yes. Do you think that Steph not speaking Spanish is a deal breaker? No, not really. I feel like you'd always learn. I could definitely learn. All right, guys, I have a challenge for you, too. I want you both to hold hands for 30 seconds. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep time and I'll tell you what to stop. Continue the conversation like this. Oh my, oh my god. god. Okay, I have to scoot up okay. for this. Okay. That's crazy. Okay, we're holding it. Count the timer. Um, what did I say? Where do you think I'm from? Either from Honduras, Honduras mm -hmm. or Colombia. <gasps> Actually, what makes you think that? Because Jacob's from Honduras and Val's from Colombia. Right. And you're very close to them, so I would assume one of those. Yeah, I'm Colombian. Colombian? Yeah. That's really nice. But I was born in Miami. My in Miami? Is Colombian. Guys, if you want to be in one of these videos, make sure to hit that subscribe button and follow me on Instagram. Every single one of the dudes that came out of this video, I got 
from Instagram. So I'm always posting on my story there to find people. If you wanna be in one of these videos, number one, subscribe. Number two, follow me on the gram. Road to 300K, baby. I want you to describe the texture of each other's hands. What? What? Um, I don't know. Like, it's, it's a hand. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. It's a hand. Is it <laughs> soft? Is it rough? Is it musty? Is it nice? Steph, what do you think about her hands? They're very uh, soft and gentle. I mean, I guess I could get used to holding them. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, period. Oh, it was really nice to talk to you, Stefan. I don't want to press the button because I really I liked it. I really liked it. I really like speaking with you. I like speaking with you too. It was really fun. Aww. Yeah, so I won't press the button because I think it's great, but I want to see what other people are. Okay, that's Alrighty. fair. Thank you so much, Stefan. It was nice to speak to you. Nice to speak to you also. Okay, bye bye. See you later. See you later. Oh, he was so nice. <laughs> I knew he was gonna do it, bro. That pep talk, I'm telling y'all. <laughs> what, what, what did you think, bro? What did you think? I saw you. She I thought you were feeling it. So cool, bro. Like, <laughs> <laughs> tweaker, he's like nah, nah, I'm so chilling, cool. I'm chilling. You, you were feeling it, or what? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, we like the vibe. Yeah, everything she was real cool. cool. She was yeah. cool. For real. Yeah. Yeah. Who knows? Bro, it was my pep talk, huh? Yeah, it was. It was, bro. Made my impression. Man. I don't know. Y'all don't know what my boy did over there, man. So, so, <laughs> man. so he lost already. <laughs> so fucking we go home. Hey, all I'm gonna say is my boy raised the bar higher, man. Damn. Let me raise it higher. Ah, no. Let me raise it higher. I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on. <laughs> Complete the setup. You haven't even seen it. Hey, I told you, bro. 2024, we we going crazy. 2024. Oh shit. We got the hug. Look, 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 look. This is where I'm gonna be talking to y'all. You feel me? Hello. Hello. Fire. Hello. Right, let's go. I'm a little nervous, and I know her. <laughs> you nervous, bro? Yeah, bro. Yeti, you not like this. Yeti. Let me shake it off. Let me shake it off. Yeah, yeah. Get yeah, back to your normal self, bro. Make sure good. Cause the Yeti that I know is confident. Yeah, yeah. We confident. We're we're lavish. We're handsome. Lavish. Full of riz, full of riz. Full of riz. Never lacking, never I don't have that much riz, though. I'm just like a nice guy, you know? Yeah. So I'm gonna just go in there. I feel like you know what to say to like get a girl to feel good. Yeah, hey, I'm 24, she's 24. We might hit it off. You know? <laughs> you know, you know. I'm getting excited, bro. Come on, come on, come on. Go get him, Tiger. No way! You're kidding! What are you doing here? Let me give you a hug. What the heck? What you are you doing gorgeous. here? Good. <laughs> what are you doing here? What's up? Let him make a video. What? I wanted to. I wanted to find love. What you mean? You're crazy, <laughs> yo. <laughs> I'm already risen. Where the cameras at? I'm already risen. <laughs> What's up? No way. Yeah, I'm here. Hello. I just, I'm surprised! How you been? Good, I've been great. How long have you been in Houston for? Since like Thursday? Oh, okay. Yeah. How long are you here till? Two days. So Wednesday. We got time. We got time. You don't know, you're kidding. We got time. Battery? I don't think this is serious. Yes. What the heck? Yes. I want you to be 100% honest. Friends. What's your favorite feature physically about Yeti? Face. Like it just makes sense. Just my face? Yeah. Like my whole face? Yeah, like it just makes sense. Like your hair is nicely groomed and everything. That's a fucking dub. Okay. That's a dub. That's a yeah, dub. Okay, okay. I like that. You're doing this just to be the video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, bro. What you mean? I think that's crazy. I'm here. We're here. Yeti. Yo. Would you ever date a woman like Valerie? Of course. What? Yeah. Why? Why wouldn't I want a woman of God in my life? Don't play with it, Yero. <laughs> I'm being honest. Why wouldn't? I don't know. Do you live a life of a godly man? You know, maybe not at the moment, but you know how they say like, you know, a guy would change once in his life for one woman. 
think the change is coming. Oh my gosh. Way. I think the change is on the way, you know? In a good way though, right? In a very surprising, I'm still shocked way. Let's go. That's insane. I know you're gonna pick me, so. We can yeah. like, just plan out the date. You got two days here. Damn, that means you leave when? What's today? Wednesday. Mm. I want y'all to ask each other, when was the last time y'all were talking to somebody? You guys were yesterday. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah, hell. Since the wedding, the guy that I had told you about. Oh, the, the wedding, one you brought? Did he bring you? No, I never ended up bringing him. I remember you told me you were talking to somebody. Yeah, yeah. that's it. Like eight months ago. Eight months ago? Damn. Yeah. That's a long time. That's good. Mm -hmm. uh, me? Last time I was talking to somebody, probably like four months ago, I think. And you're being truthful? Yes. Can you promise? Why would I lie? I don't know. Heck. I don't know yet. I'm here for a reason, bro. Oh my god, I do not. I still cannot <laughs> believe you. I can't. I just, I can't. Yo, Yeti's a good liar, man. Are you gonna ask me? I'm not even believing him. I already know that you're my age. You're 24. Okay, that's right? cool. Yeah. But when do you turn 25? September. Oh, okay. When do you, you turn 25? 30. November. Yes. Ask oh. Yero what he looks for in a girl. I was just about to ask that. What do you look for in a girl, Yero? Um, in a woman. In a woman, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was going to tell you to change that, like, you know, the girl to woman. You know? Yeah. Because I don't look anything, like, for girls. I'm more, like, woman. Yeah. Thing, you know? But, um, okay. you know, as I'm getting older, you know, definitely more into, like, the religious side of things okay. on a woman, you know? I like a loyal woman, a faithful okay. woman, a charismatic woman. Okay. Uh, I want to have fun, you know, and be able to enjoy myself with you. Um, do you think that you're that? Like, what you're asking for, are you that? Oh, for sure. For sure. I still don't believe it. <laughs> I still don't believe it. Bro, okay. Then. You don't look like a good kisser? Bruh. Look at my lips, though. I mean, I can't tell off someone's lips. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm going to have to say I don't know for that question. Damn. Uh-huh. Now, do you think she's a good kisser? I think she can be. I think she can be. You said she can be. I feel like, you know, when there's chemistry, there's chemistry. Okay. For sure. And there's chemistry. What? I mean, I just, I'm shocked. <laughs> I'm shocked. You got any more questions, Jago? Nah. <laughs> you gonna hit that red button on me or not? I'm not gonna hit it because I'm shocked. I'm not gonna hit it. So I'm gonna move on to that. Alright, time's up, guys. Hug it out. Hi, bye, Yeti. That is crazy. Let's go. The, I'm shocked. What? I'm shocked. I'm happy I got to see you. Oh, I'm happy to see you too. Bye. My boy put up. 10 out of 10 performance, man. Oscar worthy for real. <laughs> you just, just say you're gorgeous? I said you look gorgeous. <laughs> I'm in. I don't know about y'all, but I'm in. I'm in. Bro. I'm in. Did you know? Yeah. Bruh! But I can't tell if he's serious or not. Me neither! She cool. I, I did have to lie though, because like she said, oh, when was the last time you talked to somebody? <laughs> but it was the shit was like yesterday, bro. <laughs> like, fuck. Stay away from men like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's fucked up. Come on. I said no hoes up out here, boy. I said no hoes up. That shit was funny. Yeah, yeah, sorry, boys, but Yeti, Yeti raised the bar even higher, man. I'll put me back in. Oh, <laughs> Frankie, you're next. You're next. How you feeling? How you feeling? Feeling good. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> feeling confident. Feeling good, looking good, huh? Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, buddy, come here, come here. Frankie, tell me, my boy, what do you look for in a woman? What I look for in a woman? Yeah. Um. I look for a pretty smile, um, the personality, like, and a great, uh, what else? Someone I could just vibe with. Yeah, 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 someone you can vibe with. Okay, 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 I like that, I like that, I like that. Now, <laughs> do you think you have a good chance at finding love today? Finding love today? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I met her the other day, she cool people. Yo, that's right, guys. So the <laughs> thing is that they have met before, but so. they haven't had, like, a one-on-one -on -one conversation yet. So, this is what's gonna determine it all. Frankie, hey, may God be on your yeah, side. Yeah. God bless. Go to your day. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my gosh. 
Hello, Frankie. Hey. How are you? Good, and you? Good, good. That's good, that's good. That's good. How you been? I've been chilling. How about you? I've been doing good. That's good, that's good. That's you. Okay, so what brings you here, Frankie? Um, I'm, I'm here to like find love. Are you trying to find love? Yes, I'm looking to get married. Are you looking to get married? Um, yeah, I'll be down if you're down. Alrighty, what do you look for in a woman? I look for, um, I look for someone that's like nice, someone that's always gonna be there for me, someone that's, um, what else, like, yeah, just someone that's supportive. Okay. And like, yeah. How's your relationship with God? With God? Uh, it's pretty good. Like, <clears throat> I, I, I got a Jesus tattoo because that's how much I love God. I mean, Jesus, but yeah, I like going to church and yeah, how about you? I know you like going to church too. Yeah, um, I love going to church, uh, but I love my relationship with God more than going to church. Mm -hmm. um, it's something very important for me. I need a man of God. I want someone to be able to share that with and to be very into it the way that I am. <clears throat> I think I'm the guy for you. Oh, really? You think yeah. so? How old are you again, Frankie? Um, what's the question? Yes. Um, do you guys think you would make a cute couple? I think we would be a cute couple. I have to disagree. Damn. I'm ugly. Why do you go straight to that? Because... Has someone told you that you're ugly? Yeah, all the time. Oh. But I'm going to respectfully decline, Frankie. It's it was okay. so nice to see you. Mm -hmm. uh, that's alright. Uh, Wait, before you leave, Frankie. What's good, Chico? I want, I want you to tell him the reason why you pressed that red button. The reason I pressed that red button was, um, I don't feel the connection. I don't feel like the vibe. Um, I, I, eye contact is very important for me. I didn't really feel a lot of that, so. Frankie, did you feel any connection? I mean, I did, but it's, yeah. <laughs> Frankie, how does it make you feel that she pressed the red button? I mean, I don't care, because, like, if she doesn't feel me, then that's, like, on her. Respectfully. Frankie, plug your Instagram. My Instagram is playboyfrankie with two underscores. Yeah, make sure to follow me, and, yeah, because I'm just trying to find love. Period. You're gonna find your queen king. Yeah. Alright, thank you, Frankie. Bye, Frankie. Bye, bye, bye. Hey, man. Frankie's a sweet guy, man. Protect his heart, you feel me? Ladies, if y'all hit him up, make sure y'all treat my boy right. Frankie, wasn't the one, bro. Wasn't the one. Damn. Maybe the one hits you up on Instagram. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe, but yeah. this one wasn't the one. Maybe she's for somebody else. <clears throat> I really was feeling her, but things happen. Things happen, bro. Hey, the one is the one is out there somewhere for you. Bro. I'm there. I'm there. <laughs> My boy's back quick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Will, right? Yeah, Will. Yeah. All right, Will. <sighs> what do you look for in a woman, Will? Uh, focus. Yeah, you focus on her bad and her, like good heart. You know, like being there for me. Be there for you. Yeah. Got That's you. pretty much it, you know? Got you. Okay, Basically, okay, around her stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah, now do you think you have a good chance at finding love today? Mm. Hopefully. 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 <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah, so, I mean, I'm gonna be confident, I'm gonna go confident, you know, I'm pretty much like a little bit nervous, but you know. I want you to walk in there with full confidence, bro, like just strut in the room and just <laughs> like ask her for a hug or something, alright? Alright, let me see, because I gotta, I gotta look right. I gotta look right. You look good, you look good, you look good, you look good. Alright, alright. Come on, bro. You ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, go, 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 go. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I put my shoe like that. <laughs> bro, right in there. <laughs> alright, this is the one for real. Alright, this, this is like this is not a joke, this is the one. You ready? But I'm not going to hurry, bro. Three, two, oh, one. Shit. How are you doing? Hi, nice to meet you. My name is William. William, William Ballard, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. How are you, William? Doing fine, are you? Good, good. It's been a good day. Can't complain. Okay. So where are you from? I'm from Houston. Okay. I'm from Houston, uh, yeah, pretty much it. What about you? I'm from Miami. Miami? Yeah, I live in Miami. Oh, you live in Miami? Mm-hmm. How do you like it out? Um, 
I like what I know, but I still feel very lost. It's a, it's a lot of roads. It's a big, it's a big city. Yeah. yeah. How's my yeah. Um, it's good. Really? I, I love living there. I feel like I'm used to it. I don't get lost. I know my people. I know the culture. Mm -hmm. It's definitely very different from here. If you don't mind me asking, how old are you? 24. 24. How old are you? 23. Okay. I'm about to be 24 in a couple months. Okay, so yeah. you were born in 2000? 2000. So what do you do for a living, William? I'm an electrician. Okay, I'm do you like? Uh, I went to school for it. I graduated, uh, but I like like kind of like opened up my own business. That's your blood, right? Yeah, my my brother. Uh, trying to take a LLC. Okay. And start my own little business, but you know it's pretty hard. It's pretty hard, but you know, but you know, I'm taking step by step, not rushing anything. Challenge time. I want you to compliment her in a freestyle. <laughs> That's know? crazy. I know freestyle is crazy. <laughs> She want me to do something that I've never done? Yeah, 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 you got it, you got it, Will. Come on, Will. All right, I'm going I'm to do it for her, okay? I'm going to try, I'm going to try. Oh, yeah, yeah, you got some pretty lips and a nice smile. I like your dimple on your lips, like. Oh and you God. got pretty nice, nice oh, hair. Ah, uh, y'all made me do something I've never done. None of that, Ryan, bro. You know what? A for effort. Good job, Will. That's yeah. five points. <laughs> but I do love your smile. What's something physically attractive about Will? Um, I like the pierced ears. Very, very my vibe. I like tattoos. Love tattoos. I have a couple myself. For you? Yeah. How many do you have? Eleven. Eleven? Oh. They're just hidden in my skin. Really? Yeah, I have to get out of I never, I never thought you would be tight, to be honest. Really? Yeah. Do I look like I wouldn't? I would you wouldn't, like yeah. You look like a, you know, nice, you know, like, classy girl. Do you have a relationship with God? Like, are you a believer? Do you have a faith in anything? Like I do, I'm a believer. Because my mom, she's really like a, she's like a big believer. My mom, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? She's like, I guess I kind of love myself a little bit. I'm not going to lie to you. Mm -hmm. Like a while back. And she's always told me, like, you know, like, read the Bible. She's like a big believer in God. Mm -hmm. And she always, you know, like, I, I'm, I love my mom, you know, because she's like, she's been there for all of us. Right. For me and my siblings, you know, she's like, we've seen what she's gone through. Mm -hmm. And... And yeah, she's a big believer, so you know, I try to just, you know, like listen to my mom now and then, you know, type the right, like, the right mm -hmm. footsteps. All right, now I want you guys to make straight eye contact for 30 seconds with no speaking. Three, two, one. I'm like, I was like thinking I'm like doing coming off lane so we can like. Oh, my bad, because I had already been I'm gonna go pee. You come with me. Yeah, come, bro. <clears throat> You want me to record you too, bro? I'm good. All right, bad, bad, bad. I thought this was like a family friendly channel, but. Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, cool, cool, bro. That's Why are you recording me, bro? That's crazy, bro. You just said bro, recording me, bro. Really bro. Oh, bro. You can blink. I blink. Yo, you think they're still making eye contact? Wait, they're, they're talking, bro. They weren't supposed to talk. I think like, cause I got, like I was dating this girl for like six years, you know, went through so much, but now, you know, like it's been a while mm -hmm. and how long, like how long was it? Like how long have you, like since you've been like single? Like five months. Okay. Yeah, I'm not like, like five months and uh, it's just like, I went through so, what is it? What's one thing you miss about your ex? Like, I don't, I don't think I miss anything, honestly. You didn't have good times, good years? I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying we, we had, like, good memories, like, you know, like, I, I did have good memories, but it just, like, miss it. I think I went through so much, it's just, like, I'm not really missing it, you know? Mm -hmm. So I'm looking, like, and, like, when it comes to your question, what I'm looking, like, into for a girl, just, like, someone that actually supports me, you know, because I'm trying to, you know, like, I'm trying to get there, you know, my own little business started, you know? start my own little business so I want support and then someone to actually be there for me mm -hmm. and for her to you know like self self love you know because I, I feel like that's something I'm working on and then mm -hmm. I feel like if she loves herself you know we both you know like know how to we, we gotta know right. how to love each other you know and for her to be on like on her like on her back you know on her, on her stuff you know her, her own mm -hmm. thing going on you know when was the last time you texted your ex oh I haven't texted her honestly 
actually? Yeah. I so you been. broke up five months ago? Yeah, I haven't. Like, I guess, like, she, she texted me, like, I think it was like a month and a half ago. Mm -hmm. But, you know, she was just trying to see how I was doing. And then she was blowing on my phone, like, calling me, like, private and all that. You know, that I was like, you know, okay. I'm doing, I'm busy. Can I ask you, you know, like, why you calling me private? You know, stuff what like that. What was the relationship? Um, what ended up the relationship? I think it was both of us. Like, it just wasn't the same, you know? It wasn't the same, you know? <laughs> So let's say we get in a relationship, it's six years, seven years down the line, the spark isn't the same. You're gonna leave? Nah, that's the thing because I feel with her, she wouldn't even give me the support. Okay. Like, I feel like she would just like, like bring me down, you know, like, like she wouldn't want to like, I don't know explain this, it's just like, basically she, yeah, she wouldn't, I, I feel like now that I'm not like with her, I'm actually doing like more things than when I was with her, you know? Okay. So I feel like, you know, just, she would just put in. I want you guys both to stand up and stand behind the table. Okay. And I want you guys to hold hands, to get a feel for what it would look like if you guys were dating. I got the man. Okay. <laughs> Where would you take her on a second date? I'll take her like probably you know like downtown, catch a vibe, you know like maybe like talk with each other more, like get to know each other better. And well, I'm eating healthy right now because I just started going to the gym. I actually found a hobby which it was like so hard for me. So, okay. So I started a hobby, started going to the gym. I'm one consistent, like one month consistent in the gym. Okay. So. You know, I'm trying to eat better, trying to get healthy. I like, I don't drink no soda, none of that shit, none of that. Show her your muscles. <laughs> okay. You know, working, you know, starting something. <laughs> but yeah, you know, I probably take it to a spot where you know we can get like healthy, you know, and uh, and then probably just go catch a vibe at a party downtown. It sounds good, but I'm going to respectfully decline. Oh. It was so nice to meet you though. It was so nice to meet you. Valerie, I want you to explain why. Um, I think the relationship with God really was the pinpoint for me. I feel like it's your mom's faith, not really yours. And that's something that I'm really looking for. Like I want to be able to be with someone that loves the Lord, that can you know come to church with me and not just sit down, listen, like be active. You know, have the relationship with God, so that's something really important for me, and it is a deal. Right? I understand that. I understand that. Thank you so much. Nice it was you. so nice Bye. to meet you. Nice to Take meet care. <laughs> Another man down, man down, man down, man down. Damn, mm. well, hey. I tried. I tried. <laughs> she, she wasn't meant for you, bro. It's all right, man. Damn, man. Y'all should have seen my <laughs> boy, man. Damn. I ain't never seen no game like that in my life, man. <laughs> Fuck. He beat us to it. He bro. beat us to oh, it, bro. bro. You different, bro. Yeah, you different, different bro. <laughs> he got that dad wrist, huh? That dad wrist. He got that I ain't even gonna spoil it. I ain't even gonna spoil it. My boy, you ready? I'm, I gotta go after that last, shit, bro. Last but not least. Okay, boss. Now tell us, bro. What do you look for in a woman? Hey bro, I'm looking for a mean bitch. Right? I don't give a fuck. Just a mean bitch. Really to tell you where your place, bro. That's that's the wave I feel. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, okay, okay. You want, so you want uh, somebody like you want her to wear the pants in the relationship? Okay, basically. no, 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 not oh, that, no, 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 no. no. Uh, so somebody to like keep you in check. Yeah. Where she thinks she got an argument, then you just slip it away. You're like no. Nah, mm. But overall, you know, Latina. Not that, not that tall little, little under me. I'm six two. So like my cameraman a little bit like. Where you like stand next to? Yeah, him? type. How tall are you, buddy? Uh, on a good day, like six foot. You used to box that shit? Yeah. Okay. Oh, come on. Alright. Okay. One, two, one, two. Yeah. One, two, one, two. Right. Under, oh, that's right. Okay. A boss. You're a boss. Type shit. Ain't no man with greater balls okay. than you. Okay. You. Oh my god. They've been telling me that she's religious. Yeah. Muslim, bro. Oh, what? Bro. I ain't, like, oh God, bro. She gonna see my brown ass. She gonna be like, fuck, no. <laughs> like, bro, what do I do? No, hey, bro. 
You never know, bro. Bro, go get him, bro. Right. Go get him, bro. I, I want you to walk in there with confidence, bro. Okay, like, no, like, no, no. Chest yeah. up and everything, bro. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. <laughs> That's a nice ass restroom though. What the fuck? Hey! Hi. Sorry about that. Uh, what, you can do hugs or handshakes? Yeah, we can hug. Oh, sorry. We can hug. How are you? Nice to meet you. What about you? Good, good. They got you alone in this room? Nobody? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Sorry about that. How you been? How's your date? I feel like I'm the last one, so like I'm sorry. But... Yeah, no, my day has been good. I can't complain. Okay. I really can't complain. What about your past dates? They been good? Some of them. Oof. Some. I'm sorry, bro. They put me at last, bro. I didn't know what to do, type shit. But, um, do you have any questions? You want to, like, break the ice? Like, What's break? your name? Okay, my name uh, is Abbas. How do you spell that? A B B A S. A B B A S. Oh, okay. Yeah. What about you? Valerie. Valerie? Mm -hmm. Better you, go by Val. Oh, where are you from? Like, just like where do you think I'm from? Okay. Can I ask what's your favorite food by any chance? Like growing up, what was your favorite food? If I say it, it'll give it away. Really? Mm-hmm. Can I what about your favorite artist? No, it's not. Damn, that's gonna give it away too. Yeah, because it's Taylor Swift, she's American, but I'm not. I was born here, but okay. my family is from somewhere else. I don't think you're from Mexico. Okay, you're correct. Okay. I don't think you're Salvadorian. No. I don't think you're Puerto Rican. No. I'm gonna, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, is it Colombia? Yeah! <laughs> Bro, I already knew that. He capping, he capping. And I have one Pacific friend from Colombia. I just kind of lined it like that. Really? Even in my English, it comes out a little bit? Not as much. It's oh. really good. Okay, yeah. thank you. I have what else. I've been here most of my life. <laughs> You got yeah. it. Bro. Well, no, all of my life. I was born here. Well, I was born in Miami. I live in Miami. I oh. not. I'm not. Damn, so what you did? How's the flight then? You didn't even tell me you came. Damn. Yeah, I come to visit Bao and Jacob. Oh, okay. Damn. I want you to ask my boss what he has in that fanny pack. Honestly, I keep my essentials in here. Just like a GQ. Okay. But, boss, uh,. I don't keep my wallet in here. Surprisingly, I actually always lose that shit. So there's nothing right there. Okay. Um, so I'm a very picture type of guy. Mm -hmm. uh, I like to kind of keep my memories type shit. So I have this uh, class, like, you know. Okay, yeah. always with a yeah, film uh, disposable, disposable, yeah. Disposable. Other than that, uh, I used to have my cards. Like I said, I just took my wallet out. And then I always got to stay fresh. So I have the dumb deodorant. Okay. <laughs> I thought it was like, Lou, bro. <laughs> and then what if I smell? Oh, okay. You, know, you ever had that? Like someone right next to you, they smell like ass, and you're just like, oh, fuck. Mm hmm That people, yeah, some people just, I don't, they That's what I'm saying, so I don't want to be that person, or, so I, like, I spray it, because I'm very, like, sure. I want to be on my hygiene. Sure. Which, yeah. Where are you from? I am actually from Jersey City, New Jersey. I was born there. Okay. Spent a little time there in New York, and then I actually been here the majority of my life. Spring, okay. Texas. And your, and your parents, like, where are you, like, originally? Made? They're from Pakistan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, so you're Middle Eastern. Uh, yeah. What were your first impressions of each other? I like your extrovertedness. I was like, you literally came in here, you're like, hello. Like, yeah, I appreciate it. I get that a lot. I feel like that's the Jersey, New York in you, though. Okay. Because, like, I feel like upstate, mm -hmm. like, up the country and, like, New York and stuff. It'll be a little bit more extroverted. It's like loud. I, I would think, think so. Yeah, because you got to you got to to get around. Mm -hmm. I would say my first impression, uh, honestly, right off the rip, it seemed like you were a very genuine person. Okay. And I think that speaks a lot for somebody. You know, just being genuine, being careful. I feel like you care for others a lot. Mm -hmm. Is that true? Yeah. yeah. So, what do you look for in a woman? You uh, you know, just a nice, you know, like a really nice person to mm -hmm. kind of just. I feel like in a relationship, it's all about a team. At the mm -hmm. end of the day, I hate to use a reference, but you like I could be Kobe, you could be Shaq, you could be Kobe, I could be Shaq. Okay. We gotta be like a team overall, win the life. So that's what I was kind of hoping for, like just someone to be like 50-50. Sometimes you know, if you get tired, I'll put in your 50. If I get tired, you put in my 50. Does that mean like financially, or does that mean like everything? No, I I would say everything. Like let's okay. say like I feel very stressed, I would want you to you know. Bro, don't worry, you're overthinking, like, okay. you got it. Um, when was your last relationship? Last relationship? Um, I've actually only been in one, surprisingly. Okay. Yeah, and it was, I would say, 
pretty recent. I've never been in an official relationship. Really? Yeah. Okay, how, how many bodies do you have? Zero. Zero? Yeah. I'll confess, I'll be straightforward, I got one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I have zero. Okay, yeah. Because mm -hmm. I was about to say, oh, what was that? Do you believe a boss about his body count? No. Really? I don't know what to tell you, bro. I'm being honest. I don't know. Um, do you believe in anything? Do you have faith in anything? Do you follow any religion? So, in religion terms, it would have to be my own faith, like Islam. Okay. But I, I would say I'm pretty strong in that. Okay, got yeah. it. Like, I always believe that there's someone, you know, there for us. That is a deal breaker for me. I feel like for me to have someone of my same faith is very important. Don't would you say it. the same for you? Me and my girlfriend are probably the wrong, like, different religion as well. Oh, and so it works out perfectly. You have a girlfriend? Yeah. Hold on, what? <laughs> what do you mean you have a girlfriend? I have a girlfriend. I don't know who you are. Are you serious? Yeah. Then why are you on here? You got a girl? Type shit. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Um, well, that's definitely out of the question. <laughs> You can you can escort yourself out. Hello. Wait 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 wait. Hold on. Wait, a boss. Yo. Does your girl know you're here? She lets you. Ah, of course. That's my dog. That's my slime, bro. That's Not you dog. referring to your girlfriend as your slime. So what were you looking for? Like an open relationship? Like. I was just trying to see, like, just have fun and just get to know who you were. That's it. Nothing else. Wait, show us a picture of you two so I can believe that this is actually true because this is insane, bruh. I want to see her. Who has a girlfriend? Okay, wait, we gotta let Jake go see her. You got a girl on what? Yeah. What the? <laughs> I do YouTube too, bro. Shout out digital, bro. Oh, you do YouTube? Yeah, I be doing blind dates myself all the time. The guys knew you had a girlfriend? Yeah, the guys knew. You told them? Bro, we've been talking about since ever since I've been waiting, bro. What the hell? <laughs> That's crazy. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, y'all go. Y'all GG, pack it up, bro. It's time to learn Chinese, because y'all done. Bro. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I had a feeling my boy was gonna speak in because he's just like confident, yeah, like he has a like shit, business. Bro. bro, he ended up getting a kiss. Nah, I'm shit, bro. bro. You got a girl, bro. <laughs> See, I told you, bro. <laughs> she in the car, bro. bro. She in the car. Bro. <laughs> nah, bro, we was like talking, we was chopping it up, and then like I was like, it really got too deep where she started asking me about my previous relationship. I was like, I'm in that bitch right now, bro. It's not, it's not, it's not previous bitch. That shit current. Uh -huh. So then we were just talking. She was like, Oh, well, I would ask her. I was like, So where would you rank me in terms of like pre your dates? Uh -huh. And she's like, Well, you know, you're really outgoing. You're really, I really like your confidence. I was like. Yeah, so does my girlfriend. Nah, <laughs> no, 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 no. bro, I didn't know bro had a girlfriend. Wait, how'd you give you guys on you? It was a joke. Oh, oh I thought no, you were being no, that. Nah, bad, Yeti, bro. come on, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what an amazing time! Thank you guys for joining us on this video. It is time for Valerie over here to choose who she wants to go on another date with or Let's who go, she wants make the right choice Battery. <laughs> now i want to ask you a very important question do you think you might have found love here today i think that it was definitely a great experience i think um i definitely enjoyed speaking to the guys getting to know them a little bit love i don't know we can definitely see but i can't say for sure. Battery, go ahead and tell us, who do you choose to be your lover? My lover. <laughs> um, that's crazy. Um, the person that I, or the guy, that I would love to continue to get to know, just spend time with him, make sure, you know, to see the vibe through there, is, I feel like a drum roll. Yeah. Nothing! Oh, yeah. Alright, alright, okay. 
okay, okay. Hey, Wait, I was you. definitely feeling the chemistry between you two. I had a feeling that you were gonna choose him. Now, tell me, what made you go for Stefan? I think for sure, um, his relationship with God. The height. Okay, was okay. definitely the height. The height. The height. That's the only thing you were missing, huh, Yeti? Oh, bro. This is my third L this month, bro. Come on. <laughs> my boy, you still have a decision to make. Are you gonna accept or decline this offer to go on a second date? It's true. I'll accept. You accept? Okay! I like that! I like that! Okay, okay, guys, that means that you guys are gonna now go on a second date tomorrow, or we'll, we'll schedule it, we'll schedule it. But hey, guys, that's gonna do it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. I am glad that somebody finally fell in love. Man, uh, my voice. <laughs> yeah, I got love. Yeah, I got love. I got love. One, two, three, man. No wait, single man on three. Oh, oh yeah, wait, no. Yeah, yeah. You guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys. All right, let's go, let's go. Single man on three. One, two, three, single man. All right, that being said, love you guys. God bless you. We are gonna catch you on the next video.